Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I will be talking about Allah created the universe. Most Muslims, or maybe almost all Muslims, believe Allah created the universe in six days. At least that is the answer they give us, if we ask. Let us read into their books, in the, uh, what says in their books, in their Quran, in their Hadith, and see for ourselves how many days of creation Islam teaches. Surah 7, Quran chapter 7, Surah Al-Araf, Quran chapter 7, verse 54. Indeed, your Lord is Allah, who created the heavens and earth in six days, and then established himself above the throne. He covers the night with the day, chasing it rapidly. And the sun, the moon, and the stars, subjected by his command. Unquestionably, his is the creation and the command. Blessed is Allah, Lord of the worlds. So, Quran chapter 7, verse 54 says, It is created in six days it is a six day uh, creation which is good because bible says the same thing we have no problem with that although bible is more um, detailed right but it's okay now we will read surah fusilat quran chapter 41 Verse 9 to 12. Four verses. We will read Surah 41, verse 9 to 12. Say, Do you indeed disbelieve in He who created the earth in two days and attribute to Him equals? That is the Lord of the worlds. And He placed on it firm, firmly set mountains over its surface, and He blessed it and determined therein its sustenance in four days without distinction for those who ask. Then he directed himself to the heaven while it was smoke and said to it and to the earth, Come, willingly, or by compulsion. They said, we have come willingly. And he completed them as seven heavens within two days and inspired in each heaven its command and we adorned the nearest heaven with lamps and as protection. That is the determination of the exalted in might than knowing. How many days does the passage say? Eight days. Two days to create the earth, four days to place the mountains, and two days to create seven heavens. Two plus four plus two equal eight. So Surah Al-Araf, verse 54 says six days of creation. Surah Fusilat, verse 9 to 12 says eight days of creation. But relax, don't be confused by Quran because we have yet to read what is written in Hadith. Let us read Sahih Muslim 2789. Sahih Muslim Hadith number 2789. Abu Hurairah reported that Allah's Messenger took hold of my hands and said, Allah, the exalted and glorious, created the clay on Saturday and he created the mountains on Sunday and he created the trees on Monday and he created the things entailing labor on Tuesday and created light on Wednesday and he caused the animals to spread on Thursday and created Adam after Asher on Friday. The last creation at the last hour of the hours of Friday. 
between afternoon and night. So, does it say seven days of creation? It does, right? This hadith is classified as authentic because it's Sahih Muslim. Sahih Muslim hadith is all authentic. Well, according to them. So, again, six days in Surah Al-Araf, 54, eight days in Surah Fusilat, 9 to 12, seven days in Sahih Muslim, 2,789. If you want, you can write or email your sake or imam, but you know it is a waste of time since you know their answer. Allah knows best. The one answer for all questions when they are cornered, when they are stuck. That's all from me. Thank you for watching and listening. For those who follow God who is not the author of confusion. And for those who follow the other one. God bless you all. And God bless your family too. Have a nice life.